Some Englishmen state that they took and they hold India by the sword. Both these statements are wrong. The sword is entirely useless for holding India. We alone keep them. That's Gandhi. What Gandhi is talking about here is what you might call the illusion of threat power. Uh, people feel that if they're threatened, they are helpless. But actually, no one can tell you, you must do this. All they can tell you is, if you don't do this, I'll do that. So if we're willing to pay the price, if we're willing to take the risk, we're completely free. Nobody can threaten us. And that, of course, has tremendous implications for domination and violence. The reason that people are so easily persuaded by this illusion of threat is that they try to think that they're going to be able to get into a situation and get out of it without risk, without any suffering. And that's rarely the case. A nonviolent person is willing to suffer, willing to take a risk. And in that willingness, uh, he or she is immediately free from the pressure of threats. <laughs>